Okay, I've seen a lot of posts on Steam, uh, people having issues with the, with spin tires crashing, and there are fixes out there, but a lot of people can't be bothered searching through pages and pages of trying to find which ones work, which ones don't, um, and even if they trust them or not. So this is what I did. I mean, I, I got a, diff a couple of different fixes, and they worked for a limited amount of time and then stopped, but this one is actually going to disable all the time bombs that are in spin tires and fix it. Um, not sure how long the actual fix is going to be. It could be, you know, I was expecting something quick, but quick, simple, easy, it's not an issue. So what's happening with the game is people are loading it up um, to play and that's about it. It's just dying. There's just nothing there. It, the game's dead. So, um, yeah, it has crashed. Um, and that's what the problem is. Sometimes you'll get it to run for a minute. Um, sometimes it'll be on load. Sometimes you might get maybe two minutes out of it. It's always crashing though and it's driving people insane. So, first thing you'll need to do is download this program called Run As Date. Now, I'll put the link into the description so you can just click on that um, and grab it. Um, mm, mm, that's it there, bang. While that's downloading, um, it may not be instant for everybody depending on your internet speed. Um, open up your downloads, and you can see there. Um, now in your Steam, right click on Spin Tires, go to Properties, Local Files, Browse Local Files. Now, as you can see, I've got a lot of extra files in there because I've been modding the crap out of it, but um, so, now if you right click and drag and drop the file in, instead of left clicking to drag and drop, let's hold the mouse, right mouse button down, drag it over, let it go, you can just go extract here. And that will extract the files into that folder where the spin ties exe file is. Now this is the 32-bit run as date because the 64-bit one just doesn't work, but it doesn't make any difference because I think spin ties is 32-bit anyway. Um, this is the program here, run as date. So we're going to launch that, um, run, and you'll get this little menu thing here. So click on browse, select spin tires, and then let's set the date to December, I'm going to go 13, no particular reason, just sometime in December. Um, because all the dramas happened this year, so if we set it to December 2015, eh, no, no, no issues. Okay, um, create desktop shortcut. This is extremely handy. Um, call it something like spin tires uh, date changed. That'll do. I don't know. Whatever. Um, okay, so move time forward according to that. Yep, cool. Um, Yep, that's that's everything. So let's go oh, run. You'll see the game loads up. Um, but before we do that, we want to go create desktop shortcut. So we've actually got the shortcut up here. So we can just run it from that. We can close that off now. That's done. We don't need to worry about it. Um, now anytime we want to launch the game, we can use this shortcut that we've got. That will automatically do everything for us. No need to worry about anything else. No extra mucking around run the game, play, um, and no more crashes. Um, simple as that. Enjoy.